Kim Kardashian's six-year marriage to Kanye West may be coming to an end, as recent reports suggest she is done trying to make things work with the rapper. But despite a potential divorce, the couple have no bad blood and they are very cordial with one another, a source told E! News on Thursday. He's focusing on his world and she is focusing on her world, the insider said, adding that Kim wants to feel at peace going into this new chapter of her life and is focused on herself and her children. Kim and Kanye, who tied the knot in 2014, share four children, daughters North, seven, and Chicago, two, and son Saint, five, and Psalm, one. Kim wants to feel strong mentally and physically, the source continued referencing to the Coke star's rigorous 6 a.m. workout regimen. They also noted that Kardashian has kept herself very busy by immersing herself in her work, such as her popular shapewear brand Skims and her thriving makeup line KKW Beauty. She has been very busy with her business, which has been a blessing. She's really focusing on the kids and their happiness as well. Kim also has the support of her sisters Courtney, 41, and Chloe. 36, who have already volunteered to help the reality star tackle single motherhood. All of the sisters are aware of the situation and are very supportive. They all love Kanye like a brother but agree it's best they part ways, a source told the outlet. E! News previously shared Kanye's side of the coin, alleging that the 43-year-old hitmaker loves his extended family and that he and the Kardashian-Jenner clan are super close. But a source close to the situation painted a more distant picture to people as they claimed Kim and Kanye's marriage is beyond repair and that Kim is over Kanye's chaos. At this point she just wants to focus on the kids in her own life, said the insider, adding that Kim's goal is to create the best life for the kids. She and Kanye are just not on the same page when it comes to their future as a family. And Kim is okay with it. She will do everything she can for the kids to have a great relationship with Kanye, she just doesn't want to be married to him, they concluded. The couple had a tumultuous 2020 that included the rap star's failed run for the United States presidency, which appeared to draw a wedge between him and Kim. During one campaign rally Kanye tearfully revealed that Kim considered aborting their firstborn daughter North, a disclosure that left Kim furious, per a people source. Kanye also embarked on a series of Twitter tirades, accusing Kim of having tried to get him committed and insinuating that she was unfaithful. Kim made a statement referring to her husband's bipolar disorder and pointing out that the family is powerless unless the member is a minor. Eventually the couple traveled to the Caribbean with their four children in what was widely reported as a make-or-break trip to save the marriage. Although the couple put up a unified front on social media following the Caribbean summit the source told Page Six last week that they are done. The insider alleged Kim has enlisted the services of Laura Wasser, the lawyer who also represented Angelina Jolie when she first left Brad Pitt in 2016. Laura also previously represented Kim in her divorce from her second husband Chris Humphreys whom she was infamously married to for just 72 days. And although divorce may be the best route for the couple, Kim is concerned about how a possible separation may affect her brood, emotionally and mentally. The children are very important to Kim. She is worried about what a permanent split will be like for all of them concerning their well-being, explained a source to People. They continued, she is asking others for advice on how to do this. But for the past few months and even longer, trying to be a normal family has been challenging and frustrating. She wants to move on. Kim's concerns stem from personal experience, being that her own mother Kris Jenner divorced her late father Robert Kardashian in 1991. The split came after Kris had an affair with the much younger soccer player Todd Waterman, but she and Robert managed to become friendly after the divorce. Thank you.